class welcome back to the algebra class here we want to solve x plus 2 xy plus y equals to 18 so doing this the first thing we need to do is to factorize x so here we're going to have x into bracket 1 plus 2 y plus y equals to 18 now looking at this we can see that there's nothing for us to factorize here so we do this multiply both sides by what by 2 so doing that we're going to have 2x 1 plus 2y plus 2y equal 2 multiplied by 18 is going to give us 36 okay so with this add one to both sides okay add one to both sides so that we can able to factor out one plus two y so here we have two x one plus two y plus one plus two y equal 36 plus one so with this we have 1 plus 2 y 1 plus 2 y which is easy for us to factor out so with this we are going to have 1 plus 2 y 2 x plus 1 equal 37 now looking at this value we have we have 37 here 37 the factor of 37, since 37 is a prime number, it can have um, only two factors, so with different signs. So here we have 1 multiplied by 37, that is the first condition. Okay, we can have 37 multiplied by 1, we can have negative 1 multiplied by 37. Lastly, we can have negative 37, sorry, yeah, negative multiply by negative 1 so these are the four conditions we're going to have so we are going to put this into consideration so for case 1 so we have 2y plus 1 equals 1 and we also have 2x plus 1 equals 37 so with this we have that our y will be 0 and x is going to be 18 that is for the case 1 so this is gone for case number 2 so we have 2y plus 1 equals to 37 and here we have 2x plus 1 equals to 1 so we have y to be 18 x to be 0 that is for case 2 so we move straight to case 3 for case 3 that is we consider the negative part of it we have 2y plus 1 equals to negative 1 2x plus 1 equal negative 37 with that we're gonna have y to be negative 1 and x to be negative 19 so we've done this and the last rule which is case 4 For case 4, we have 2y plus 1 equal negative 37, 2x plus 1 equal negative 1, so with this we are going to have y to be negative 19 and x to be negative 1. So these are the solutions and also the values for the question given to us.
Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you next video. Thank you.